My name is Brad Kitchstein with Allen Engineering. I'm here to go over the MSP 445 rider with you. This is a super nice early entry machine. It's easy to operate, simple to use, easy to maintain and take care of. You've got an independent pitch on both sides. You've got a forward and reverse left to right on the right side and a forward and reverse right here on the, the left side. You got a spray button right here on the left hand controller. Kill switch in the foot pedal and in the seat. Throttle pedal right here. Ignition right here on the left. This is a very simple, easy machine to take care of and operate. A few of the things I'd like to go over before you do a startup on this machine is a few of the things you want to check and make sure they're taken care of. Grease the trial arms, grease the thrust bearings. Make sure you're squarely planted in the seat for the kill switch on there. If you lean forward on that, the machine's not going to start up or it's going to die shortly after you start it up. Uh, you've got to choke if it's cold. Choke the engine, start it up. Don't consistently keep hitting the ignition switch. You'll burn your starter up. Only let it run for about 15 seconds. Shut it off, then wait 30 seconds and try to start it again. Go over these, these, these simple things. Spray system right here. You got two spray nozzles. You got a retardant tank in the back. If you lose, if, if for some reason it's turn around not spraying water when you first start this up and put retardant in it. Loosen up the spray caps right here on the back of these spray nozzles. And you also have a clear cap a filter on the back. You can loosen it up. Hit the spray button, turn the key on. It'll operate, it'll fill them both up. You'll see water start coming out or retarding. Tighten them both back up. You should be good to go after that. Uh, easy things to get to on this machine is pretty much everything on here. This is how you remove the front panel on here. And you can get to the front of the engine where the carburetor is on this. Also, we have a heat shield built on the front to protect the rider from being away from, or the uh, operator from any heat coming off the engine. This is the easy way to check out the engine or service most of the things on it. That simple. You just pop the seat up. You can get to almost anything on here. You got your oil filter right here. Your fuel filter is right below, down below me on the left. You can check your engine oil right here. You can change your engine oil right here. Just loosen this up. And if you've got any questions on what year, make, or model this is, your serial number is located right underneath the seat. It's a 38 Kohler Command EFI. Uh, as we go into the future, you're gonna see a lot more of these machines out in the field. They're easy to use, easy to operate, like I said. And it's a simple machine. Make sure when you lift this machine, four point sling, and you uh, probably hook up to these. Also, grease the thrust bearings daily. There's decals all around this machine to uh, keep you up to date on that. And if you lose them, replace them. It's important. So that way the next owner can actually keep up with it. You got a two year warranty on this machine, two to three year limited warranty on the engine. Call one of your local reps if you need one. This is, uh, I'm Brad Ketchside with Allen Engineering. This is MSP 445.